Welcome to Google Cloud Security Showcase, a special web series where we will focus on security use cases that our customers can solve with Google Cloud. My name is Varsha, and I'm a customer engineer at Google Cloud. Today, we will be talking through one of the top questions that we get from our customers. How do I protect my users from unsafe websites with Google Cloud's WebRisk API? We all know that URLs contain unsafe elements like phishing, malware, and unwanted software, and it's often impossible to find this before it compromises your users. That's why we've built WebRisk API, a new offering from GCP that enables any company to find unsafe URLs before their users do. WebRisk includes data from more than a million unsafe URLs, and we keep it up to date by examining billions of URLs each day. Here's an example of how WebRisk can help in practice. Let's say there's a company called Acme Tech Reviews, a site for local tech events like RSA. Users can post all kinds of content, which is great, and attracts more users too. But as Acme grows, this also attracts attackers trying to compromise Acme's users. Bad content creates security issues for the site and its users, driving those users away. Attackers exploit Acme reviews by posting unsafe links via an email submission feature. To defend their users and the site against these attacks, Acme decides to use the WebRisk API to filter all incoming posts for unsafe content. Acme just needs to extract the URLs from the posts and send it to the WebRisk API, which will let Acme know if a URL is unsafe or not. Acme can then decide to post these URLs or not on their website. Since I know many of you are eager to see what the code actually looks like, here's a couple of request bodies. As a developer, you can submit URLs to see if they are unsafe, as well as the threat types that are relevant to your business. URLs can be submitted directly as hashes as well. If the URL is known to be unsafe, the WebRisk API will respond with the threat types and expire times. Expire time refers to the time until which a URL should be considered unsafe. Negative expire time refers to the time until which a URL should not be queried again. And now that Acme Reviews has WebRisk installed, it can remove unsafe links from their platform, which means their site is safe again for users and their growth can continue. And that's how, with data on more than a million unsafe URLs, WebRisk is here to help find unsafe content before your users do. Thank you for tuning in. Please visit cloud.google.com security for more content from Google Cloud experts.